I'd like to talk about my friend Mac here. Mac is a leopard gecko. Leopard geckos are semi-desert species of reptile found in the Middle East in countries such as Pakistan and Afghanistan. Their habitat includes rocky outcrops and shrub areas. Now if you look at Mac, you can see she has a nice long body and this big fatty tail at the bottom. She's also colored with oranges and yellows and even some purple. She also has some spots and blotches on her body. This does give an attractive look to her of her to us, but it also serves a very special purpose. In the wild, this would help make it difficult for predators to be able to distinguish her from the background that she was on. Predators of leopard geckos include foxes, snakes, and birds of prey. Now I mentioned this big fatty tail. This fatty tail serves another unique purpose. First, it acts like a reserve of energy. Since food in the desert is hard to come by, this, act, this gives her enough energy if she has trouble finding a meal. It also acts as an escape method. If a predator were to come and grab her by her tail and pick her up, leopard geckos can actually detach their tail from the rest of their body, giving them a chance to escape. Now, leopard geckos are insectivores, meaning that they're bug eaters. Mac's favorite foods are crickets and mealworms. But in the wild, leopard geckos also eat spiders and even scorpions. Leopard geckos can live to be about 15 years in the wild. But in captivity, with proper care and maintenance, they can live to be 20 or even older. While they are commonly seen in zoos and even pet stores, they, they are unfortunately seeing a decrease in the natural populations in the wild. And the reason for this is being that they are, their land is being taken over by people. And while they do make great pets, I do urge that you always do your own reading and research to make sure that you are able to properly care for such an animal. Some more unique things about leopard geckos is they're not like many species of geckos that people think of. First, they don't have specialized toes that allow them to stick to walls and be able to climb on surfaces. Also, unlike most species of geckos, they have eyelids and they can actually blink their eyes like you and I. But like most other species of geckos, they do still lick their eyes on occasion. Now I hope today I was able to spark some interest in leopard geckos and I hope that you've enjoyed our presentation of leopard geckos.